Well, here we are again, live at the Iowa Metaphysical Fair here in Des Moines, Iowa. And we're doing lots of readings, and we've got lots of folks here. Uh, and we're going to be showing, sharing today a little bit about exactly why, what people get out of a hand analysis and uh, the, the uh, secrets that get revealed in their palms and in their cards. And I'm going to hand this over to my assistant, Everly, who is going to give you some uh, further direction shots. Feel free to put comments below, share with, uh, post with me, share it with your friends. But in case you've never been to a metaphysical fair, this is kind of what you can expect. So we're going to hand this over. And she's going to stand up and kind of cruise around a little bit. She's on camera live now. So you can talk to There me. we are. So now we're watching Linda okay. work. So, you're your choice. Does she have an opening? Uh, it's good. Uh, you're also the six plus. Okay. Element air. So, your left hand is higher. Okay, right hand is higher. Two plus higher. And how many minutes? Okay. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Air. And six is older special mission. So, the Six of Clubs is the card of mental stability, so it's kind of fun. And higher yeah. Speak up, Linda. Now, as we work with, with folks, I'm going to have them doing a little bit on their cards and doing a little bit with their hands. This is just a little brief mini reading. Normally, when I do a full session, I take prints. And I uh, spent four or five hours on your friends, and then we come. But right now, we're just looking at some of the highlights and unraveling some of the secrets. Okay, so as a six of clubs, it's a higher purpose card. And, um, so, and it's also the mind. So you have a higher purpose card. Hold up your hands. Okay. Straight and sense. You also are a major influence. Okay. So we got lifeline. Lifeline has nothing to do with what you want. It must do with your statement. And you're 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 very sensitive to the external environment. So you're not going to watch that. This line is very fun. So you're very sensitive to the external environment. And things that destroy the very general you got a pretty average head line here, so you're fine. Over here, you've got a really long head that we'll talk about in a minute. You've also got a very sensitive heart line. Being in the physical world might be a, a little bit of a challenge for you because you're so highly sensitive. You're going to be sensitive to thoughts, you're going to be sensitive to different substances, you're going to be sensitive to the movements. A lot of high needs. And you're also very artistic. You also love to be the sharp things. You like to head things up. You're also a little bit shy. Uh, a little bit of security. Is very All right. All right, so. You also want to be respected. You want to be listened to. You want to really understand what you mean when you say things is not. Really understand where you're coming from. Yeah, that's really, really important. And um, there's an old saying that you better be understood. And you seek understanding rather than being understood. So the more you ask questions about others, the more you really focus on what you can offer, then you're going to find the communication. Alright? You also are running a lot of energy. Uh, a lot of my So you might learn to uh, you want to learn to meditate and you want to learn how to really relax. Because you the computer goes a lot. Now you're still very young, so it does have it does play in it. Alright, so let's let me see what's going on. You've got a heart line that is what we call the heart line. Okay? The hermit is the element earth. I remember how I said you're a Taurus, which is an earth sign, and it's a comfort zone here. 
I work a lot with the elemental balances. And so you've got with your with your element uh, earth, comment on our duets, not topics. Alright? And show the love by doing that. The phrase is go away, don't bother me and visit. Uh, but they're just as loyalty. They desire freedom. Now do you sing or do you do anything artistic? Because these are also very artistic type of things. Okay. Yeah. Okay, good. What Taurus music is right? So these are very these are creative music. These are very, very artistic, very sensitive. So if you like to draw, what kind of drawing do you want? Yeah. Okay. Let's see if there's anything that supports that. Love to do that. So uh, over and out for now. Thanks for joining us.